tremendous round of applause to our governor, Chris Christie. The perils of an embrace from a Democratic Hudson County mayor are many. Yes, there are votes to be had here, even for a Republican, if that Republican is Chris Christie. But the other side of that embrace is the risk of getting caught up in local controversies, of which there can be many in Hudson County. State Senator and Union City Mayor Brian Stack, though, gave a full-throated endorsement of Chris Christie today. I ask not only Union City, not only Hudson County, but New Jersey to join behind Christie, Governor Christie's leadership in his state. New Jersey's in great hands. The governor was in town to cut the ribbon for a renovated and rechristened Colin Powell Elementary School, paid for with funds from the school's development authority, made possible by the chummy relationship between one of Hudson County's most powerful politicians and the irresistible political force that is Chris Christie. I have to tell you that there's not a week that goes by in the State House in Trenton where I don't hear from Mayor Stack about what's going on here in Union City, and he's either on the phone with me bragging about something the great that's happened here, or he's on the phone with me telling me something I need to do to help him and you make Union City even better. But Stack is carrying around some baggage this week. A local opposition group called Union City Concerned Citizens is charging that Stack plugged the nearly $3 million municipal budget hole with a non-existent Port Authority grant for road repairs. It was something Stack tried to avoid talking about with his special guest nearby. A couple questions. We're not, we're not going to talk about the Port Authority grant today. We'll discuss it. Yeah, go back, later please on go today. back. Today's about the school. The money's either there or it's not. If it's not there, it shouldn't be reported as being in general revenue. The governor wasn't talking to us today, and we had to chase Senator Stack down the block to get him to answer questions on the Port Authority grant, which he dismissed as straight up politics. Obviously, those people from that is so-called so attorney out of North Bergen that's put up by my opposition, obviously doesn't understand a grant is anticipated. This is an introduced budget. It's not an adopted budget. And I'm guaranteeing you the work will be done as we've always done. Senator Stack was confident enough that these charges would not rise to the level of scandal that he rolled out the red carpet for the governor today. And the governor seemed comfortable enough with Brian Stack to accept the red carpet treatment. In Union City, I'm David Cruz, NJ Today.